Uh, 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 Hello there. Welcome back to another edition of What's the Shizzle in My Hizzle, My Brizzle. Today, in the cooking pot, we have Prometheus. This is actually the first time I've seen this. It's directed by Ridley Scott, the same guy that did Alien, which is, this is a prequel to the entire Alien series. Alien, Aliens, Alien vs. Predator, all of it. One big universe. Get this beginning. And you know what? For me, the King of Games 98. I give it a 10 out of 10. Must watch. Word. Huh. Prometheus. You know, I never did get around to watching this. Hey guys, what's up, what's happening? You got the King of Games 98 here, and today I'm going to be finally talking about and reviewing Prometheus. So, <laughs> this might come as a shock, but, because this is literally coming from the guy who just watched Halloween for the very first time. If you saw that video, then this will make more sense, but if not, I never was really a fan of scary or horror movies. I was kind of a pussy for a long time and just kind of stayed away from them. But I did always like a good monster movie. I love Alien and I love Predator and Godzilla, I guess, because that's definitely considered a monster movie. And I always liked, you know, those franchises, movie franchises. Now, I heard of Prometheus, I want to say, from James Rolfe, the angry video game nerd. Don't correct me on that, though. But I'm pretty sure he reviewed this on one of his videos for Monster Madness one year. That, ironically, he does during the month of October for Halloween. And it was, it was either James Rolfe or it was either the Nostalgia Critic. One of them. And... I remember he reviewed this, and then he actually, one of them did, and they said that this is the prequel to the first Alien movie, and I was like, holy crap, I need to get this. So, now having sat down and watched it with Kevin, I can now say Hi. <laughs> that I really enjoyed this. So if you've never seen Prometheus and are kind of curious as to what it's about, here's how the back of the case sums up the movie. A team of scientists and explorers. A team of scientists and explorers travels to the darkest corners of the universe, searching for the origins of human life. Instead, they find a dark, twisted world that hides a terrifying threat capable of destroying them and all mankind. Prometheus. Um, what can I say? Uh, what can I tell you guys about this movie? This movie is from 2012. So that's pretty crazy to think about. This movie is already 8 years old. This movie is has a runtime of 124 minutes. So it's essentially 2 hours and 4 minutes long. And, well... Okay. This is what I was hoping with this movie, that it would answer some questions I always had with the very first Alien movie. And, you know, those questions were, where did the Xenomorphs come from? Where did that ship come from that had the... <laughs> that had the eggs with the face huggers on, you know, in them? Where did they come from? I expected this to tell me that and give me those answers. It did not. It did not. Although, that's not discouraging how I felt about this movie. Overall, I did enjoy this movie. This is a really good sci-fi movie that, I don't know, would, would would you call this like a horror sci-fi movie? I don't creature? I'd call it a creature feature. Okay, okay. Yeah, because I, I, I really don't know if this would be considered horror. I don't, I don't really think so. No, I'm, uh, yeah, I would say nah. creature feature at most. Yeah. I really enjoyed it. As a prequel though to Alien, I'm, 
I'm I'm struggling with that and I'm having a hard time with that because you see, again, I'm I'm, I'm really hung up over. I expected answers to my questions for how the xenomorphs get there, where the ship come from, the that was housing the eggs with the face huggers in it. I didn't get those questions answered. Uh, Ridley Scott, I love you. I love you for creating the whole alien movie franchise and these movies. They're great. Moi, I just wish I could get some questions to my answers. Without further ado, my final rate for Prometheus is a perfect 10 out of 10. I would highly recommend if you're a fan of the alien movie franchise. You might like it a little bit more than I did. Thanks for watching, guys, and happy Halloween.